Good day to you across time and space. My name is Gregor Kappa and my experience with Parsing grew in 25 years of scientific computing and coding. Today I'm focused on text research and psychometric theory. This lightning talk, Iterable Parser Combinators for Fast Parsing in Pure Julia, demonstrates the Julia package combined parsers. Parsing is everywhere, literally. Countless parsing libraries exist, so why another one? I had discovered Julia and got enthusiastic about types. When I migrated my parsers, I removed the tedious part of interfacing parser language to take apart with programming language to recombine. The title slide defines taking apart and recombining both in one expression. Robust parsing with type checking that cuts development time. In the following seven minutes, I will demonstrate combined parsers, which is interoperable with regular expression, text parse, and with an API to include custom parsers, and integrates into the general Julia base API for parsing, matching, and iteration. It's fast like the PCRE C library, thanks to the amazing Julia compiler. And the second part of the talk then is a showcase for the brief syntax of combined parsers, which enables reasoning about the parser instead of obstructing, like regular expressions tend to be to do. If you disagree, check out the palindromes example in the manual. So regular expressions are the standard to parse. The ER string macro constructs a combined parser from a regex. The regex syntax and structure are laid out side by side with the combined parsers API. This regex example repeats A any number of times, B at least once, C optionally, and so on. So you can simply replace R quotes to RE quotes in your code and use the base match API. Note, when you regex capture D matches repeatedly, you get only the last match. With combined parsers, you can transform with nesting and capturing such repeated values into actually any Julia type. Julia's IT iterate API lazily parses with backtracking combinatorics if a parsing is not unique. Similarly, all matches in a string can be iterated. The RE string macro features PCRE compliance. Tested with the PCRE C library unit tests, the package is succeeding in over 3,000 tests on nearly 1,000 regular expressions. Failing cases are discussed in the manual. Features include basics, atomic and capturing groups, back references and subroutines, conditionals, and lookarounds. The same unit tests are used for benchmark comparisons with PCRE. Most benchmarks are faster with combined parsers, as indicated green in the scatterplot of timings on log scale. On average, combined parser is 26% slower than regex, however, because regex captures perform badly compared to the recommended approach uh, in the showcase that follows now. This simplified showcase in a few lines defines a combined parser, parser from scratch, much like the packaged RE string macro does in about 600 lines. A simple regex consists of some repeatable pattern, here simplified any character, and a repetition suffix or no quantifier when the character is matched exactly once. Note that the result types are inferred. Repeated patterns are repeatable patterns followed by repetitions transformed into a combined parser's repeat. Simple regex then chains any number of such repeated patterns and transforms them into a combined parser's sequence. This is sufficient for cases without curly braces. Custom Repetitions are in curly braces, with a minimum number of repetitions as a text parse numeric, followed optionally by a maximum number of repetitions, a comma, and maybe a second numeric. If the comma is missing, 
max is missing the value. If the max number is missing, it defaults to a thousand. The result time is a name tuple with min and max values. The name tuple is then mapped to a unit range handling missing max values. If you forget this transformation, a type error will be thrown because it does not match the repetitions result type. This saves time. The simple regex showcase is a functional combined parser resulting in a parser, the ABCDE repetition, successfully parses the sequence way back in the first example. I'm thankful for many great works, most notably Julia's parametric types and multiple dispatch compiler. Scala's fast parse package, the Elm parser, because functional parsing is great. Parser Combinator was an inspiration. It does, however, not follow Julia 1.0 iteration API and small units. Combined parsers is focused on regex, text parse, and most importantly, types and compiler optimizations, and thus no fork of Parser Combinator. Automat.jl provides deterministic finite automata with actions. Actions make code rather convoluted with enter, exit, mark, and emit. It would be interesting to investigate interoperation when Automa supports varying code lengths and UTF-8. This brief talk could not list all features of combined parsers. Fast prefix tree parsers are included in the package and parsers can even arbitrarily depend on the parsing itself for example, to balance tags in XML. Memoization, side effects, and logging are supported, and more. The documentation provides user manual and tutorial. There is a comprehensive package for Wikitext. More is coming. Next is primarily the syntax freeze based on your feedback and optimized transformations. Julia type inference in combined parsers helps automate the data pipeline. Maybe combined parsers can help with some of your work. I will be glad to support if you have any questions. I'm maintaining combined parsers actively based on this work. I now focus to release the Filing Forest platform, which is inferring schemas for tables and GraphQL from your parser-defined data domain, even for recursively nested types, and enabling efficient computations. These currently proprietary packages are default over configuration, for fast integration. Please contact me for contact collaboration. Thank you.